Hello, Kulas, and welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barca, where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with Pierre Emerick Aubameyang, who have just taken to social media to reveal how he felt to make his Barcelona debut. We are going to be discussing on everything he had to say. Then, secondly, we are going to be talking about this report claiming that Dutch Giants Ajax are eyeing a summer reunion with Barcelona right back Sejino Des, of course, with Nusa Mazrai and Nicolas Taglafico facing uncertain futures. We are going to be discussing much about that as we move ahead. So, guys, as we get right into it, please make sure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, give this video a like and make sure to watch this video right up to the very end. Former Arsenal striker Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang has taken to Instagram to send a message to Barcelona fans after making his debut for the club. Of course, the Gabon international left the Gunners for Barca this January and could end up being an exciting signing for Barcelona as they look to rebuild after a difficult few years. It remains to be seen if Aubameyang would deliver the goods as he's not exactly been performing at the peak of his powers either for a while now. Still, he's a big name signing for Barcelona and fans will no doubt be pleased to see what he's happy to have finally pulled on the famous JC. Going by his word on Instagram, he said, Wearing this JC for the first time, what an unbelievable feeling. Strong team performance and huge win for us today. Barcelona had a busy January, having also signed Ferran Torres and Adama Traore, while club legend Dani Alves also recently returned for a surprise second spell at the club, scoring in the recent victory over Atletico Madrid. Aubameyang came off the bench against Atletico and fans will hope to see him make a real impact for Xavi's side soon. Then on to the next story of discussion. According to Vita Jess, Barcelona defender Sejno Des has emerged as a transfer target for Eredivisie giants AFC Ajax heading into the summer transfer window. Dest is a product of the Ajax Academy and spent 8 years at the club after joining their youth setup back in 2012. He made his first team debut back in 2019 and featured 38 times, scoring 2 goals and registering 6 assists. Impressed by his performances, Barcelona shelled out 21 million euros with a possible 5 million euros on add-on to secure his signing in the summer of 2020. However, Desi's time at the Camp Nou has been a struggle as he has failed to carve out a place for himself in the starting 11. Even though he got plenty of opportunities under former manager Ronald Koeman, the United States international could not perform consistently. He now finds himself behind a 38-year-old Dani Alves in the pecking order under new boss Xavi Hernandez. To date, Des has featured 60 times for Barca but has you know, started just 12 La Liga matches in the ongoing campaign. With Barcelona targeting a summer move for Chelsea defender Cesar Aspilicueta, question marks linger over the future of Des at the Camp Nou, and it seems like his former employers Ajax are eyeing a reunion in the summer. The Dutch heavyweight has set to lose first choice right back Nusa Mazrai with his contract expiring in the summer. Interestingly, the Moroccan international has been linked with Barcelona along with the likes of Everton and Aston Villa. In addition to that, Ajax could also be parting ways with left-back Nicolas Tagliafico. The Argentine remains on the radar for Barcelona after they missed out on his signing in the recently concluded January transfer window. The potential departure of two full-backs in the summer would leave the reigning at the DVC champions short on numbers in that position. So as a result, Ajax are targeting the summer move for Des to fill in the right-back slot and add depth to left-back considering that Des can fill in on the opposite flank as well. But with his contract with Barcelona running until the summer of 2025, the Dutch outfit will have to shell out a significant sum or potentially use Taglafico as a bargaining chip in that deal. So colors, with that we come to an end of this episode. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so so you always stay in touch with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time, bye-bye.